You may have seen stories like this before. <laughs> this new kid has a run-in with the school bully. Yet, the boy getting punched isn't me. I'm the bully and that's my fist. William, you've been in this office practically every other day since coming to this school. Now I know it's tough getting used to new teachers, making new friends, but I'm gonna have to get your mother involved now. William, I need you to look at me. I'm gonna ask you, as a friend, to come to me if you have any problems. I don't mind helping out a student or two when it comes to lunch money or a place to go when they're angry. Recess is over, so you can head back to your class now. Did you get in trouble again today, Billy? It's none of your business. Sounds like you did. Mrs. Young says that being a bully won't get you anywhere. Mrs. Young can eat dung. I'm sorry. Mrs. Young is a very nice lady. And what'd she have you do at school today? Well, today we had a puppet show about fire safety. There was a Dalmatian in a fireman's hat mm -hmm. that taught us not to play with matches and avoid using candles. I'm going to be late tonight. I got stuck working the double shift. Dinner from last night should be in the fridge. Make sure you go to bed on time. I'll see you when I get home. Hi, Mrs. Hammond. William was in my office again. What's for dinner? Uh, Mom will be home till after your bedtime again. We have chicken. We had chicken last night. I want grilled cheese. We have chicken. Grilled cheese, grilled cheese, grilled cheese, grilled okay, cheese. Okay, okay, fine. Yay! Grilled cheese then. Cookie. You could split the cookie? No! <sighs> Bedtime? Yep, you know how mom gets. But I want to stay up. Alright, I'll make you a deal. Brush your teeth, climb into bed, and I'll read you a story. Five minutes later, Joy tapped him again. Todd ignored her, so Joy packed, poked him in the back with her pencil. Todd pretended he didn't notice. Joy got up from her seat and sharpened her pencil. She came back and poked it in Todd's back. What page are you on? She asked. Page five, Todd answered. Boy, are you dumb, said Joy. I'm on page 29. It isn't a race, Todd whispered. Five minutes later, Joy pulled Todd's hair and didn't let go till he turned around. What page you on? She demanded. Page six. Did Mommy make us lunch today? Uh, no, she left us lunch money. Can I have it then? Uh, no, she made me promise to keep it till we get to school. Okay, just remember you can't break promises. Okay, so we'll get your jacket. trouble yesterday. What are you having for lunch? Your mom didn't give you any money? Dummy, I'm talking to you. You hear me? I'm not talking to you. Leave me alone. I asked you if you had any lunch. Last time. What are you having for lunch? Uh. Better than this, Jakey. Alright, I'm sure your mom would let you with some money for a drink or something. Hand that over too. I need to buy lunch now. So does my sister. Now what do you have?
I'm gonna tell the principal on you this time. I mean it. You do? And you're dead. All right, remember, the bell's gonna ring very soon. You have money now. So, who was lunch for me today? You? Oh, really, thanks. You know, I think I just love the sandwich. Just go William? I thought I told you to come to me if you couldn't afford lunch. I need to sit you by yourself. Come on. I'm gonna go contact your mother. What? 